really lovely setting for you. The context for our game today. It's the Emirates Stadium, the home of Arsenal. Martin Tyler along with Alan Smith for you. We have Premier League action for you coming right up. It's Arsenal against Liverpool. Yeah, real buzz around this ground. Full house. A lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Well, a couple of star names that we're looking at today. What do you think, Alan? Well, two excellent attacking players we are treated to seeing. I'm really enjoying good seasons and I'm expecting a bit more of the same today. This is the Arsenal lineup. Looking at the lineup, he's got all the components in place, hasn't he? The manager for the pressing style of play has been a feature of his team. Yeah, and uh, many an opponent has found it difficult to cope with. If your touch isn't spot on against this aggressive type of closing down, you're going to lose it in dangerous areas. It's Arsenal to kick off. Nicola Pepe. Hector Berry. Here's Torreira. Lacazette. Now Danny Ceballos. Can't keep the ball at the moment. Here's a chance to whip it in. Good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. Mohamed Salah. And it's Williams. Well, he's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception. Made it look easy, actually. Tierney. Jaka. Shokdran Mustafi. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah. Fabinho. He's had a go here. He stopped it pretty creditably, I think. Referee is pointed for a corner for Liverpool. The manager just hoping that that miss is not going to come back to haunt them. They are creating chances, but that was a costly miss. Corner's taken. Excellent work from the keeper. Good defensive clearance there. Wijnaldum. Now Sadio Mane. Fabinho trying too hard, really, and losing the ball because of it. And it's going to be a, a throw here. Tierney. Went in quickly there. That'll be a throw. Excellent defensive tackle. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. The goalkeeper will get this one, no problem. To Jones. And Sadio Mane. Can go in from here. Hit the first man with the cross. Obama Yang. Granani Chaka. Looking for possession in this deeper role is Lacazette. 
Continue to knock the ball around, looking for the opening. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Arsenal very stable in many ways. The uh, USA ownership seems to be sure of what it wants from the club and there's a, a lot of dignity still at Arsenal. Oh yes, they run things in a certain way and as you say, I know there's a bit of dissatisfaction about absentee owners and all the rest of it. At the end of the day, they want to see success on the pitch. He might have put his teammate in here. And the chance for Firmino. And he scored! Oh, no wonder he goes over to thank the lad who set him up there because that was a wonderful move. I think they've practiced that one on the training ground. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? Liverpool have taken the lead. Goal for Liverpool. Number nine, Roberto Firmino. Well, Liverpool leading, but it's a pretty slender margin at this stage. We've got half time coming up, and they want to get there with this lead still intact. Yeah, quite often you see those kind of stats. Arsenal controlling possession, but you can see the manager down there is less than happy. Obviously, his team's losing. That's Mane! He's kept it out. The We've got two added minutes. There will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. Wijnaldum. Roberto Firmino. Firmino, who works hard to get the ball, has got it now. Good vision. And the referee looks to his assistant, who's got the flag up, it's offside. Well, the referee has signalled for half-time, and it's 1-0 here. It's Liverpool's game to win, really, now they've got the uh, lead at half-time. Off they go for the second half. Fabinho, now Jones, it's Mane, lost his man, good position for the cross. Well read, and a key time for the team here. Pepe, oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Well, that's reflecting their confidence with the lead and rather than sit on it they're going to try and extend it yeah they've been the better side haven't they and that would have wrapped things up i think every manager wants his team to be ruthless and that was such an opportunity no wonder he's unhappy at that miss wijnaldum mohamed salah now he's got the ball what's he going to do with it Pepe. Room now out of the wing. Now Williams. It's Salah now. Roberto Firmino guided through. He's through here. Real chance now. What an important goal this may well be. They're two ahead now. Building a platform for victory. They've made it look very easy, Alan. It isn't always as easy as this. You need to say two should always score against the one goalkeeper. But nobody panicked. No, nobody did. I think they realised they had time. They realised they'd broken through. And it was two against one. And uh, they made it count. Just widen the margin here to 
number five, Jorginho Vidalgo. Nicola Pepe. It's going to be a substitution for Arsenal. Wijnaldum. Well, he's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception, made it look easy, actually. Here's Bayerin. Here's a chance to just stretch the opposition with a bit of width. Continue to knock the ball around, looking for the opening. Gets his cross in. It's not really a way, poor clearance. And 20 minutes to go. Gets the ball out wide with time to assess the situation. Maybe he'll cross it here. Firmino, top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. Goalkeeper almost got there, but it wasn't a strong enough touch. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself, isn't he? Having got a touch on it, feels he should have done better. Well, here's the goal again. Liverpool want to make a change here. It's turning out to be an embarrassing scoreline, really, as we're underway again. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. Shokran Mustafi saw the pass and dealt with it. Jorginho, Wijnaldum, with Firmino again. Fabinho. Shots on here, and he's done it. Patrick, goal number three here, and it's a perfect day for the player. Well, some players might switch off if they've scored a goal, even two goals in the game, but he's greedy for more, in the best way, I mean, and he's got a hat-trick. Yeah, he's been a danger from the start. His work rate, his, his runs off the ball have been top class. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. Well, here we go again, and they can't wait to get the ball back from the kickoff and try and get another one. Nicola Pepe towards Aubameyang and they're looking good when they get the ball out wide as they've done here couldn't get it past the first man to close him down it's Salah now it's an Arsenal substitute who's getting ready got the ball and they're going at the opposition with speed oh the counter-attack was on and it's come to nothing Fabinho it's Salah now. Roberto Firmino looped over the defenders for the forward to chase. Mane with the cross. That's a very weak cross from a very good position. Arsenal with the substitution. Mohamed Salah, now can he cross it? And in it goes towards the far post. Keep to collect this one. Pepe. Aubameyang. Nicola Pepe. Granit Xhaka. That's it, final whistle. It was absolutely extraordinary, exceptional, elegant. Excellent. Well, he goes across and grabs the match ball from the ref, a hat trick, and that's to be treasured by any player.
top, drip, drop top, drop top, smoking no cook in the hot box. Fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that. Cooking up dope in the crock pot. We came from nothing to something, nigga. I don't try no.